Woo, hey everyone, this is Adara from Daily Crypto Trade Sales coming to you live, live from, from somewhere in Asia, guys. It's a great time to be live. And right now we're seeing that uh, most of the cryptocurrency right now is down. We're seeing that the Bitcoin is down right now about 1.79%. We're seeing Ethereum is down. BNB is down and everything is kind of down right now. But we're going to be talking about Dogecoin and what the freak is going on with Dogecoin right now because some people, some analysts, and I'm saying that we're seeing these multi-year patents uh, playing out and we could see a huge parabolic rise uh, for, for Dogecoin pretty soon, guys. So, guys, remember, all this is financial advice. Just an OG in the house express my opinion. I'm not a licensed financial advisor. You all freaking know that, guys. So let's get into the content without any further delay. Don't forget to go down there, smash the freaking likes, show some, show some awesome awesome love out there guys and let's get into the content right now you can see right now that the, the bitcoin chart right now we've seen that the bitcoin has kind of kind of gone down a little bit uh, we're getting a little bit of recovery we did have this we did have this huge spike down downward spike uh a lot of longs got liquidated but we're seeing that the, right now we're seeing that the, the bitcoin is coming back a little bit trying to try to come back and, and make some make some moves guys we're seeing that right now dogecoin on the shorter time frame hopefully you guys can see that uh, Dogecoin is, is is in the last 15 minutes trying to trying to make uh, some positive uh, gains, some positive momentums out there. Uh, we're seeing that Dogecoin right now is just under 11 cents. Uh, we should be getting ourselves back up there. I'm not too worried about it. You shouldn't be worried about it. And we're we're gonna jump into why some analysts are thinking that Dogecoin is about to explode. Dogecoin is about to leave the freaking station, guys. And we're gonna see a huge parabolic move for Dogecoin pretty pr pretty freaking soon, guys. Uh, so let's jump in. Let's jump into that and let's get into it, guys. What I've been seeing recently, we're seeing a lot more whales and institutions are buying more and more Dogecoin. We're seeing that over over uh, 108 million worth of Dogecoin was bought in the last 24 hours. We're seeing that the number of transactions for Dogecoin are going up. We're seeing a lot of activity on chain for Dogecoin, which is pretty pretty positive, and this usually sparks. Uh, and indicates that we could be seeing a huge freaking breakout, guys. So you know, I, I think a huge, a huge uh, freaking breakout is possible. And uh, if you take a look at the Ali Moran's chart right here, you can see here that we've had multi-year pattern that has been playing out for Dogecoin. You can see here we have uh, we have a, a downward consolidation, descending triangle. We have a pop. Then we reach uh, a new all-time high. Then we kind of descend down consolidate downward uh, descending triangle, big pop. This is where we went up to almost like uh, 70 cents in the previous cycle. And now we're seeing that we had this consolidation. We've had a, we had a bit of a breakout. And a lot of people are saying that our new target for Dogecoin could be, we could be, we could be seeing, you know, uh, a dollar coming in pretty soon for Dogecoin. So there's a lot of positiveness out there for Dogecoin. Uh, we're seeing that crypto is kind of in the doldrums right now. It's kind of like, you know, it's kind of like a seesaw, right? You know, things go up. Uh, we see a big short squeeze happening. Uh, then things go go up. Then we see a, a long squeeze. Uh, stuff gets sold off. So this is kind of kind of the kind of the typical cycle out there. Uh, what's happening, what's going on uh, right there for, for, for Doge. So that's kind of what's going on for crypto right now. And overall, we're seeing that crypto right now is just doing its thing and uh, things are looking pretty good for Doge. A lot of people are thinking that huge, huge freaking Dogecoin breakout is going to be happening soon. I, I believe that. I'm, I'm feeling pretty positive. Uh, you know, I think, uh, you know, a lot of the dominoes are lining up for Dogecoin. We've got a lot of network activity. Uh, we've got institutional buyers. Uh, we've got this multi-year chart that I just showed you that kind of indicates that Doge is definitely going to be uh, breaking out because, you know, we can see the history has been repeating itself with Doge. Uh, and, I, and I really think this is still a good time to accumulate Doge. Absolutely a good freaking time to accumulate Doge. Don't sleep on the Doge. I remember, you know, some, 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 what I do is I have a balanced portfolio, 50% Bitcoin, 25% Ethereum, uh, and 25% uh, the top 10 projects that's kind of what i'm looking at some of the things i'm i'm thinking about is uh i still believe that solana is going to be a big a big play uh, a big pick i think a lot of stuff is going to happen with solana don't sleep on solana we're seeing ethereum just kind of like sleeping right now kind of like a sleeping giant but you know it is the number two uh cryptocurrency out there uh it never hurts to have a, a good bag about that uh xrp you know with the extension of the court case that's happening well, i'm not too confident that we're going to see anything exploding soon for xrp uh, BNB, 
BNB is going to do its thing. Binance is the largest cryptocurrency exchange on the planet Earth. So you definitely want to be holding some BNB for sure. Definitely you want to be doing that. Uh, but overall, things are looking pretty peachy keen for, for Dogecoin. Uh, you know, I think that we're really not going to see the height of the bull run. Probably not until November, guys. So, you know, we're going to see some chippity choppity chop for crypto. We're going to see some chippity chop for uh, Dogecoin. I remember fundamentally uh, Dogecoin is going to be following uh, what Bitcoin is doing. Uh, but we're seeing good accumulation, good activity on Dogecoin. And keep in mind that Dogecoin uh, has stayed in the top 10 uh, spot for years, for years now. So just keep that in mind. Uh, that you know, yeah, it's a meme coin. People say it has no utility. We still got X payments that could be uh, coming around the corner, so that's freaking awesome. Uh, that can happen. We still got Elon Musk is being a little bit more vocal right now. We did see that uh, yesterday when he came out with the DT out there, and uh, yeah, if DT wins in uh, if DT wins uh, the election, we're gonna see uh, that Bitcoin is gonna pump, guys. It's gonna pump. But typically, we're gonna see stuff is pretty flat. Uh, until after the election. That's pretty much the cycle for that. That's what's going on, guys. So, guys, be blessed. Be well. I'll see you in the freaking next one, guys. A great time to be alive, and I uh, love you guys to death. Uh, it's great to be back. I love it. Get ready for a freaking huge, awesome, boom chakalaka, freaking Dogecoin mania. Freaking Dogecoin mania is going to happen soon, guys. So, I love it. You love it. Let's get it. Peace out.